We're almost finished with Owen Call for a month already. Originally, I was going to review the Call for Classic Artemis Fowl, but after reading Warp, I feel that Airman will be more appropriate. Airman is a historical fiction, another first for Colfer, but he dominates the historical adventure genre with his rich, powerful, and potent story. So remember my review of Half Moon Investigations when I mentioned that, well, why don't I just show you? Half Moon Investigations is vastly different from the Artemis Fowl series and the Supernaturalist in genre and style. I think that is the reason why it just didn't get the credit that it deserved. People weren't expecting it. But me, I love to see it when an author is broadening his style. I just want to say it again. I love it when authors experiment in different genres. Haven't you ever wanted your favorite children's writer to try their hand at a different, even older style? Writing different types of stories not only keeps their ideas fresh and original, it gives us, the readers, even more of our favorite authors to love. While not inappropriate for middle grade and tween readers, Airman, I think, will be much more appreciated by the young adult crowd. Or, you know, those in their early 20s. And just saying, I've been reading this one to my dad and he loves it. Anyone who loves a high-flying adventure is going to love it. The story is part Batman, part Count of Monte Cristo. Connor Brokart is a swashbuckling scientist who wants nothing more than to build a flying machine. And perhaps win the heart of a princess. But when he's accused of a heinous crime, the flying machine becomes more than a dream. It becomes his only means of escape. It's an intense, emotional roller coaster packed with fun action and awesome flying contraptions. A caution for younger readers. This book does contain a little bit of swearing and some violence. Nothing graphic, just your run-of-the-mill fight scenes. Expect a more serious tone than you found in most of his other novels. That's not to say this book doesn't have humor. He always manages to have humor. But he's just found the right balance of humor for this style of story. Airman by Owen Colfer gets five stars, and the only unsatisfactory thing I have to say about this is I want more. A sequel to Airman would be awesome because it's a great book with so many fun characters. It's just over 400 pages and yet I still didn't feel like I had enough time with it. Just a tip, if you're planning on reading Warp, or already have, Airman should definitely be your next read. I'm not going to tell you why, because I don't do spoilers, but it just adds more fun to both reads. You can thank me later. Speaking of Warp, I'll be reviewing book one next week, so tune in Wednesday, and until then, tweet Warp and Owen Culper Month to spread the love.